everyone, this is Kalpana here. In this video, we are going to solve a differential equation using variable separable method. So, let's get started. Problem, solve 3 into e power x tan y dx plus 1 minus e power x into secant square y dy equals to 0. Solution, given differential equation is a given differential equation. into e power x into tan y dx plus 1 minus e power x into secant square y dy equals to 0. Okay. You can write this as first term equals to minus second term. So, in the next step, we'll write all the functions of x and differential dx in one side and all the functions of y and differential dy on the other side. Okay? Then, you can write this as 3 into e power x by functions of x. 1 minus e power x into differential dx equals to minus functions of y tan y into dy. Okay. Now, you can bring this to LHS. Then, 3 into e power x by 1 minus e power x into dx plus secant square y by tan y into dy equals to 0. So, here the variables are separable, right? Now, we can perform integration. Then, 3 into integral e power x by 1 minus e power x into dx plus integral secant square y by tan y to dy equals to 0. Okay. Now coming to the first integral or integrand of the first integral. This one. We are having e power x by 1 minus e power x. Right. If you consider the denominator as f of x, you will have f of x equals to 1 minus e power x, right? Then, f dash of x will be minus e power x. That is d by dx of 1 minus e power x, which is equal to derivative of constant with respect to x is 0. Minus derivative of e power x is e power x. So, this is equal to minus e power x. Right? We know that integral f dash of x by f of x into dx is equal to log mod f of x plus c. Right? For f dash of x equals to minus e power x. And f of x equals to 1 minus e power x into dx. We will get log mod 1 minus e power x plus some integral constant. Right? In order to apply this formula here, we need a minus symbol. Okay? So, for that purpose, what we will do is, we will simply multiply. Okay? Since minus into minus equals to plus. Okay, we'll take one minus inside the integral and one remains outside. Okay. Then, this becomes minus 3 into log more 1 minus e power x plus integral secant square y by tan y into dy. Here, if you take denominator as f of y, that is tan y, 
then f dash of y that is dy dy of tan y is secant square y. Here also we can use the same formula for y. f dash of y by f of y into dy which is equals to log mod f of y. Okay. So in the place of f dash of y you are having secant square y and in the place of f of y you are having tan y. So this is equals to plus log mod tan y. Since both the terms are in log, so we'll take integral constant as log c. Okay. Then minus 3 log 1 minus e power x plus log tan y equals to log c. We know that m log n is equals to log n power m. Then you can write the first term as log 1 minus e power x power minus 3. Right? Plus log tan y equals to log c. Then This becomes, since x power minus n equals to 1 by x power n, right? So, you can write this as log x power minus n. Consider it as x power minus n and written as 1 by x power n. Okay? Plus remaining terms as it is. We know that log a plus log b equals to log a b. Then the sum of first two terms will be log a that is 1 by 1 minus e power x whole cube plus okay into tan y equals to log c, log a plus log b equals to log a into b, okay? Now, you know that if log a equals to log b, then a equals to b. So, from this we will get 1 by, that is, tan y, 1 into tan y is tan y by 1 minus e power x whole cube equals to c. Then tan y equals to c into 1 minus e power x whole cube. Therefore, tan y equals to c into 1 minus e power x whole cube is the general solution of y. That is the given equation. Okay, so this completes the problem. So we have seen a problem from variables separable method. Hope you'll understand. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye-bye.